Last up on Haller for an hour tonight, we have Underlings. Underlings is, from what I understand, a single developer project that uh, kind of works like a survival league game uh, where you're going around crafting, building, and you know, exploring kind of, kind of a little mine, yeah, you know, a little bit like Minecraft, but it, it's 2D kind of Zelda ish perspective. Uh, what makes it stand out is the fact that you are actually playing like a little imp dude, and you're basically it's a, like a fantasy world, and you're playing on the demon side. You're you're in the, you're you're you know you exist amongst a bunch of evil creatures, and you are you are surviving there, which is kind of interesting. I like that idea. So we'll see what they do with it. It's still in a pretty early version, 0.553a. So we will see how this is, though. Um, of course, before we begin, if you like the video, do give it a like. It helps out a lot. And even more helpful is uh, giving me a subscription if you haven't already. Uh, also, you know, if you want to see my content early, talk to talk to me directly, interact. Check out my Twitch. We do stuff early there. Well, I'll do stuff a, a day early than what you see it on uh, YouTube. So, And we have a really cool Discord community you can check out as well if you fill in the desire to be social. But yeah, let's go ahead and fire this up. Apparently, this does have multiplayer. Huh. Working products can be very buggy. Host a new game that up to three other players can join. That's pretty cool, even if it's buggy. All right, let's just start a new game, though. <clears throat> All right. Oh, see you later, Pop. Ankle bitter? <laughs> You mean biter, probably, but... Mean-looking little goblin, not as green as all the other goblins, but still hated by most creatures. Starting items, axe, and some bread. <laughs> Angel, red demon with fearsome horns on his head. Crawl from the depths of hell, looking for a cooler place to live in. <laughs> Starts with a pickaxe and three bread. Bob, <laughs> okay. Trout Dracula's lost and forgotten cousin, always looking for some of that tasty red goodness. Okay, probably needs to suck blood. Starts with a spear. I guess it makes sense to start with a weapon if he needs to suck blood of things. Leather jacket and leather leggings. So he starts with some armor because he probably has to suck blood. Eyeless, a cyclops who got cast out of his clan for having too many eyes. Whoops. Uh, starting items. Ocean's guide accessory increases swim speed. Wood, fi wood fishing rod tool. Yes, as we all know, cyclopses love fishing. Um, so who should we be? Starting out... I mean, this is a game where we can get our own tools and stuff, but what 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 seems like an interesting start? Goblin, demon, vampire, or cyclops that isn't a cyclops? Hmm. I feel like I just started with the goblin, because he's probably default, and also the axe would probably be useful for starting out. Oh, hi, Crimson, and thank you. Crypsy, you can now claim a free rocks box. So that's Sub a new thing. Killers. Bob. I'm going, be, I'm going to be Goblin for now. World size. Let's make it big. Difficulty? Sand, uh, normal sandbox or hard? Normal. World seed. Okay. Um, can can we do letters? Only numbers. Um, okay. We'll just do that. Let's create random. See what happens. Game freezes. Well, that makes sense. It's probably generating. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love those... I love the dark ghosts emanating from that building, which look like... <laughs> just scribbles. I need to configure his takeover a castle. Oh, I see it. One well, that looks like a crab claw. I see it. The upper upper right, right one. Also, nicely done, Crimson. You got a buddy. <laughs> Perhaps choosing wor huge world was a mistake. Okay, here we are. So this is a development build. Yeah, this is a very early version. I don't even think this is out. But that's fine. Is, uh, is there not much sound? Can I kill that bird? It's probably not. It's up there. Can I kill this? I did it. I am the most lazy axe swinger ever. Can I? Okay. 
The sound is very quiet, isn't it? I turn it up. There, maybe now you can actually hear things. Listen. Can you hear that? Hopefully you can hear that now. I had to turn up my own speakers, or head own headphones. What's this? I want it. Uh, oh, is that inventory? Ah, oh, it's inventory. Okay. So, oh, there we go. Well, I don't even, uh, that's an onion, apparently. Is there sound? If I hit things, there is sound. If you can't hear, I'll turn it up more. You guys hit more sound now. That's that a pretty fast key, tree cutting, actually. I did turn it up. Hello, evil wolf. Ow. Oh shit, I am almost, I, that almost one shot at me. <laughs> Never mind. Also, they are legless wolves for some reason. Well, that, that went poorly, but I guess that, that makes about as much sense. You don't immediately attack a wolf. Upon spine, but at least I can get my items back. All right, there we go. Um. You can barely hear. Okay, max with volume it is then. And also, we'll. Maximum volume it is. Oh god, music! I found music, guys. Is that loud enough? I had to turn up the music to make it spawn, apparently. Cherry for that. Is that too loud? Or is it just right? Please let me know. Alright, try out try that out for size. How's that? Also, if you're wondering what I'm doing, I'm just cutting things, I guess. Oh, look at all this food. That's probably gonna be handy. Probably gonna need to figure out how to craft in a minute. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay, so I started with a stone axe, but it looks like I'm gonna have to make some wood tools. I, uh, no, zero, okay. Need an actual pickaxe for that. Oh, that is a loud saw, hello. Uh, oh god, okay. Let's put like... Yeah, that's a good balance. I think that's fine. I mean, I guess... Can I... Can I kill the multicolored birds, or... See what I can get right now. Best way to learn is just to. Given how the wolf took took me out, I probably should like get some armor or something together. How I like to start a crafting game is just by wandering aimlessly, getting some materials, and then seeing what I can craft. So I don't really know all the recipes and stuff yet. Cannot attack birds in the air. Okay, I didn't think so, but worth a shot. Yeah, if I just collect food, I... general rule of thumb in a survival game: as long as you can get some food together, it doesn't really matter what you do. If you can get, if you can get some food, if you can keep a food stock, and then. Uh not die to, like, monsters, then you're generally going to be able to make progress. I've generally learned, so... 
This axe is about to break. Fortunately. Oh. Well, time to craft. <laughs> Let's see. Wood pack, pick, wood, wood pack axe? Pack axe. Uh, it'll do. Actually, you know what? Make a wood pickaxe. I'm gonna beeline for some rocks. We'll make stone tools immediately. I guess I saw some rocks over here. Where, where, where were the rocks I saw earlier? Are these rocks? I don't know what they are. Anyways, these are rocks, though. Can I break? Th this looks like iron. Can I? Okay, I can't mine this. Wasn't sure if a wood tool will do it, but it looks like it's fine. Also, we're on day 114. Guys, we are flying through this game. We played 114 days already. All right, so iron ore, okay. Um, maybe I should just try to make iron tools immediately. Do, what do I need to make? I guess I, did I see a crafting table. We'll, we'll make a crafting table here. Actually, wait, where's that default spawn point? Actually, can I make a new spawn point with a bed? Respawn point in lower difficulties. Reef bed. Okay, that's what I thought. How do I make that? I need more. I need more uh, leaves. Okay, I guess that makes sense. So, all right. I'm thinking this little spot here with the gray rock. This seems that this it's right next to that too. This is a good spot. I'm gonna set up a base here. I don't really need a bed, I'll just work off the natural respawn for now. I'll make a bed later if I want to really branch out, you know. Do we have a map? Ooh, I think I do. I hit M and the game froze. Oh wow, okay. If you're wondering, the, lap, the map seems to be a bit leggy when you open it. Probably because it's a very big world. Okay, well, I don't- I, opening the map seems to have caused a great deal of lag, so I'm not going to do that again. Oh no, it actually like... Oh, it really did let cause lag, holy shit. <laughs> well, um... Hmm. Well, it's an early version, so I'm not surprised it might be a bit buggy. Now it's not running well, right? You guys can't see it? It broke, yeah. Alright, fine. Let me, um... Let's... Okay, let me exit the game. Because it is behaving oddly now. Now that I open... It. So we don't open the map. Never use the map. That's fine. I never use the map in Minecraft because it took too much effort to make one anyways. So that buffering wasn't actually buffering. That was actually the game itself causing frame drops. The the frame the game was dropping frames to XSplit. XSplit wasn't losing frames. Just to confirm, it was running one hundred percent fine until I uh, opened the map, right? <laughs> Okay, so we just don't open the map. Yeah, that should be fine. Wait, you gotta regenerate the terrain or... Oh well. I was hoping loading would be a bit faster. Hopefully it still is. Well, you know, it's hard to make a game that load that a randomly generated game can be pretty load and heavy. You know, it can be lo it can be pretty uh, computer intensive if, when it's not optimized. And this is a development build, so. I can excuse it to some degree. There's a lot of optimization that hasn't been done yet, probably, for the game, so... That's fine, I just want to open the map. Okay, let's see, is it running okay now? I mean... No? I mean, it is for me, but what you guys are seeing... No. You know what we should do? I, I have an idea. Let, let me, let me, I have an idea. I know for, I'm almost certain this will make a big difference. 
Okay, yeah, so it's final the tile screen. That's what I thought. Okay. It's probably should be the demon because I want that pickaxe, but also small. The game is clearly not well designed to handle huge, so why don't we go the opposite direction with it? We'll make a small world. Not only will it load faster, but I'm sure the leg... Yeah, look at that, how fast it loaded. And let's open the map to see what it does this time. Yeah, it instantly opens. It's not broken. Here's our here's our world size, I guess. Okay. That is a bit small, but that's certainly big enough for my purposes of checking this out. Um, all right. All right, let's immediately look for rocks. That's what I'm here for. Does this cause a rock? Hello. Are you a rock? You don't seem to be a rock. You didn't give me a rock. <laughs> wasted, a third, wasted a fourth of my pickaxe. Oh, what did I get out of this stuff? Hold on, what's this? <gasps> Iron ingot! I want to break more gravestones. Oh, instead of having to smelt iron ore, I could just get... I could just find gravestones and, and get ingots, apparently, for me. Why do gravestones have ingots? I don't know. Let's not question it. Hello, slug dragon. How are you? All right. Hello, literally a plant from Link's Awakening. How are you? All right. Okay, well, I know what I'm doing now. I'm going after gravestones. Let's, uh, let's keep, let's look out for those dark environments, I guess, because that's where they are, I guess. I should wait, is there another one down there? Ooh. Red crystal. So it might have been a lucky drop. Maybe Gravestones just drop some good items occasionally, and I happen to get an ingot on first try. I don't know. Hey, bats. You're evil, aren't you? Oh, okay. Where there's bats, there are Gravestones, though. Let's look around. Is this lava? Well, it kind of looks like it, but not. Uh oh. I have angered all the small, hostile entities in the area. Oh shit! Oh, you get hurt in the map! Actually, you know what? I'm gonna try something. Making one more save, because I'm gonna try something. Uh, let's, yeah, again, make him. And, I, I just want to see something. I'm learning, I'm just seeing something about the generation. I'd make it a few generations, basically. So, okay. Interesting. Notice how there's another square open up over here? That's kind of odd, isn't it? Anyways, let me start with... I'm sure that just making a smelter isn't a big deal, so we'll just start... We'll just grab normal rocks. Oh, there's another gravestone. Uh, let's see what it does this time. Ow. Oh no, a guy with a shovel showed up. I am the slowest attacker, by the way. Oh, another one. I will destroy this. Okay, ow. That's fine. So the shovel guys are just going for me, all right. So can I like... Oh, I can. What, what happens if I break my own gravestone? If anything. So don't even see like... These are like gardening trowels. These were gardeners in their past life. All right, that did, that did literally nothing. All right. If you want to check the map, do it quick if you're in combat. So why did bats pack such a punch?
Rock. More trial, guys? Come on. Gold ingot. That I can't pick up for some reason. Thank you. <laughs> so it does seem like it's random, by the way. Answers that question. But I can get all the skelly he skeleton heads. <laughs> They're barely structures. Kind of hard to pick up items. That might be intentional, though. Can I? Yeah, I can. I can indeed go in water, if you're wondering. Might slow me down, though. I can't even find any rocks, guys. Uh oh. Potato wolves are back. There's still a bath. I guess. I'll say the agro is kind of ridiculous, isn't it? The biomes are really scattered, aren't they? Like, there's biomes kind of all over the place. I died. I guess. I. What? Why did I die exactly? <laughs> I am not sure what happened. Interesting. Poison mushroom? I... maybe. But it didn't like even expl... oh, here we go. Finally, some rocks. Yeah, I feel like the biomes are a little too scattered, so like you can not find what you're looking for pretty easily by just not uh that took way too long um are you are you evil okay you are evil as well watch out it's a dust bite well to be fair it's not too different from silverfish ow ow stop ow holy crap they just never let, let you they never let up <laughs> Oh great, my death markers don't disappear unless I delete them, so... If I were to die repeatedly, then my death markers would start to confuse me after a while. Of course, if I'm all dying in the same place, I'll figure it out, but... It, it seemed like it exploded on me, but there was no explode animation, so I'm kind of perplexed, you know? Nope, not out. For fuck's sake, I'm just here for rocks. Leave me alone. Look, I just want stone tools. Leave me alone. Ow. Okay. I can keep walking back, man. We can keep this up forever. This is a, kind of a scant number of stones, but I suppose it will do. I don't like the fighting so far. If like I'm so I'm sure if I got a proper weapon, I wouldn't be attacking so slow. But as it stands, it's kind of ow, dude. Just let me pick my stuff. And the anger range is a little bit obnoxious. Yeah, that's right. Go away. Leave me alone. I shall have a humble beginning with stones. Just grab as many stones as possible. Then we'll go back to the spawn point and kind of work around there, so that way if we die again, it's not even a big deal. We have a bunch of stones. I should be able to make some stone tools, which... Minecraft has taught me one thing in life, and that is never mess with wood tools because they suck too much. 
Okay, well. Alright, where's the where's the beginning again? It's like over here, I think. I'm gonna just start gathering things. Like I did with the like I did it with the first character. But not until uh, I get back to wherever I started. Wasted Durablade is probably going to be less of an issue when... Uh, I believe I need some wood to make the... Uh, actually craft the... Well, I don't want to make a wood pickaxe. I want to make a... Met oh, crafting table. I need a crafting table. Vine, stick, and logs. Alright. I guess my future is punching trees for a while. It'd be nice if the spawn, the initial spawn point was listed, because I, get, I don't know where it is right now. I think it's like below me somewhere. I'll make some weapons later. Again, they're probably just wood and thus again. Like, would you make a- do you make a wood sword of Minecraft? You don't make a wood sword of Minecraft. You want to fight something, you're not going to use a wood sword. Maybe stone. Stone sword's okay. But wood sword? <laughs> no. You, you just skip that tier if you could help it. Also, we've seen how aggressive the enemies are, so I'd like a better- I don't- I don't think I would just start with just wood. I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to gather up, uh, wood, what, what was it again? I guess the leaf bed wouldn't be terrible to have either. I need vines, so wood, just hit sticks and wood and, are those vines? Do those count as vines? I think they do. Are you vines? Yeah. Oh, that was, I looked like two, but it actually gave me four. Also, this is a lot of food right here. We, our spawn points are right next to a bunch of food. I appreciate, I approve of that. It's actually quite a bit of food. I mean, I don't know how much... I haven't figured out how to eat, actually. Like, carrot, edible. Like, okay. Maybe I just need to have it in my... Ah, right click. Okay, got it. Have it in your inventory, right click. Or have it in your hotbar, right click, I mean. Makes sense enough. One hit, one hit logs, not bad. Yeah, I don't see any reason not to just set some stuff up near the natural spawn point, so let's build a crafting table. And place it down. Maybe I'll make a house eventually. I'll, you know what? I'm going to build in such a way that I can put a house down after the fact if I want to, so there we go. Yeah, I see here. Let's open up some stuff. What did I get access to? I got some more... Hmm. Access to more wood tools, huh? Well, let's make a furnace from that. Masonry table used for stone crafting. Here we go. Ah, oh, fuck. I need iron ingots just to make stone tools. Are you serious? I need iron ingots. Not just iron ore, but iron ingots to make stone tools. I don't understand the logic of this quite. Mm -mm. Hmm. Yeah, that one leaves me a little perplexed. Well, just consider the logic. Consider the logic that if you wanted to make stone tools in Minecraft, you had to build something that required you to smelt iron. Just think about that for a minute. Well, the first is easy to make at least, so I'll make that. It does mean, however, that I wait. Is that seriously? Am I seriously locked out of stone tools until I do that? Wow. Okay. Um. Okay. I guess I'll make wood wood tools for a while then. Oh okay, yeah. Actually, wait. Hold on. Is there a way to make uh? Hold on. 
I'm, I'm, I'm trying to find something here. Let's see. Book at staff. Oh, what's this? A weapon? Use is 100? Hmm. Waypoint. Marks location on the map. Ironing a stone brick. Okay. Okay, there's one thing very distinct missing from this list of things we can build. Do you notice what it is? It's becoming a large issue that I don't see it now. Do you see what's missing? What basic Minecraft-ish item is missing from this list of items? It's actually going to be a huge concern if I can't figure this out. Oh, there it is. Never mind, I found it. <laughs> I need twine. Oh no, how do you make twine? It's basic material. Never mind, I found the chest finally. God damn. I was like, what do I do when I run out of space? Alright, so I need twine. What the hell? Where the hell did I get that exactly? Oh, I placed the tree. I guess it's fine. So I need twine to make a chest. Well, I kind of need a chest. Like, my usual strategy of just grab everything in a survival game only works if I can store it somewhere. Also, it's very dark. Night is night. Night is, in fact, quite like night. Well, I need more vines. And I also need to figure out what twine is. So let's just wander a bit. Maybe this is twine? This ain't, yeah, well, this ain't Don't Starve, from the looks of it. Good thing, because that's always a tricky mechanic. Okay, what did I get? I got bamboo. I mean, I guess that makes sense, yeah? That could be useful, I suppose. Now come here. Come here. Now come back. What's this? <gasps> Grapes! Did it? What I do? I got firefly essence and some slimy meat. Yum. All right, let's see. I got ice. Oh. Well, I'm out of space now, so how do I how do I throw stuff out? <laughs> There's gotta be a button for that, right? You, you would think. Alright, well. Mm, let's see. I need... I need to figure out where the hell I get twine. But also I need some more vines. Backspace Q? Yeah, I tried those. Wait, hold on, keybinds. Roll space? What? I can roll? Drop, drop held item Q. Oh, hold item? But I am holding that. Drop held item Q. I'm not seeing it, man. Drop hold item Q doesn't seem to do anything. Rolling works, though. Oh, that's what that button in the middle is for. Okay. Oh, I found some stone. What's that sound? Oh, I found more vines. That's what I need. I need those. Raid is coming. 
Channel Legends? Can I wait till morning? Hello. Ooh, pumpkins. I'd love to pick these up, but I can't, so I won't, I guess. Sure would love to- I sure wish I could actually throw out items, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, I just figured it out. Also, I got rid of all of my sticks, and they deleted immediately. Oh, good. Well, would you like to, uh, So you- when you're holding it in your inventory, press Q. Also, pigs attack me. Okay, good to know. Or rather, that pig attacks me. Probably should not. <laughs> okay, well, I got rid of all my sticks, which I kind of needed, but at least I figured out how to do this now. In other words, it's just kind of stupid. Which is good to know. You have to hold something in your inventory and then, yeah. And then it does it. It's a bit of a shame, uh, but oh well. I don't remember where my spawn point was. I really should put down a waypoint. It's not a bad idea. Once I can. I oh, hear some sticks though. That's good. Place my little mistake, I suppose. Probably should have been. Ex oh my god, hello! <laughs> it's a bear. Oh, that's where I was. Okay. What's the ability to see coming back? Yeah, that's a good question. Well, just unreasonable, man. Okay. It's fine, I don't need those items. That, uh, they're gonna despawn, aren't they? <laughs> oh god. It's not an iframe roll. It's not an iframe roll if you're wondering. I am struggling. This bear is shit. Roll, roll, roll. Nope. Okay. I can't pick up items fast enough to actually grab them. Okay, get over here. Waha, fuck you. Okay, bye. <laughs> Not messing with that shit. That's the one enemy I can't really run away from. Oh, I shouldn't lead him over to the... If I let him over to here, would he just spawn and kill me? That would be both funny and sad. Um... Oh, there's twine. You can make it with... Okay. Well, this guy wants to give it a shot. Oh, bitch. Alright, whatever, man. Bitch, do you think I care? I'm right here. Fucking die. I'll make a little... Oh, this is actually perfect! Wait. This is great. Kill me again. You might wonder what the hell you mean by that, Charm. Well, guess what? I could spend a lot of money on setting up a waypoint. Or I could just put a cavalcade of gravestones right here and then I know where I live. See, it's perfect. Also, when is this thing- when is this guy gonna die, exactly? Yeah, thank you. Say, so check it out. Where do I live? I wonder. Oh, maybe it's where I have a circle of skulls. <laughs> Alright, um... Anyways, uh, what was I doing? Before I 
got in a big fight. <laughs> uh, twine for armor, huh? That might be useful. I need more. Apparently, I need more logs, so. Right. I guess I'll just start by. Um. What can I smelt? Can snow be smelted? I'm not really sure. No. All right. Let's see. Uh, what what can I smelt then? Well, I guess the gold. But oh yeah, right. I wanted to make a. I remember what I want to do. I want to make a chest. Five twine. All right. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Chest, please. Oh okay. Oh yes, I know I'm out of items. That's why I need a chest. Thank you. Oh, they're very small. Oh, no, never mind, they're very big. Also, holy shit, that's not very much space. All right. Uh, is there no... Oh, good, you can shift-click. All right. To be honest, I don't need everything here, but... Eh. I'll just put away the stuff I don't really have an immediate use for. There we go. So make one of these. All right. Also, that chest space is not very good. does use their ability for no good reason because sticks are easy to pick up. Oh, here we go. What did I just get? Pops. In other words, I just got something I don't care about. Alright, I should probably actually take a lot of things out of the chest and just throw them away. I don't really know. I just, I, I'm a little annoyed I can't just make stone tools. But I'm gonna see, oh, a secret. I'm gonna see how, see what I can do to get them. a little bit of a problem. Saplings, you, you cannot punch things when holding a sapling because you want to, whenever you're holding it, you want to place it, basically. Which actually proves to be kind of annoying. Where's my base? There it is. Okay. Let me keep, keep track of it. Is that just bamboo or... Sugar cane. That's a classic, I guess. Probably good for cooking, which, ironically enough, I'm not going to worry about cooking, though. Let's keep wandering around for now. Cautiously go over here. Oh, I full up on... Okay, sure. Oh, yes. Oh, um, I don't like this area. Oh, 
Oh, I do not like this area. Oh, well. I wonder if infighting is a thing with any of the monsters. Hi. Are you the raid? Maybe they are the raid. I'm much more scared of bats, though. Just a log there, hold on. I'm really logging some good progress here. Oh, hi there, I didn't see you. Cut damn bats. Seem to have a bigger acre range. All right, fine. Come out up here, then. Ow. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll have to punch you, then. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. You cannot kill me permanently! I don't care! That's a lot of enemies, actually. Perhaps building a house wouldn't be a terrible idea. Slightly problematic. Oh god, I picked up a tree. Which means I can't punch, because tree. Which actually is kind of a problem. I don't like that design. Well, he's got, some of these guys have armor, actually. This must have been the raid. I think I killed the bat. As long as I pick up every item group when I die, I should be fine. Just keep swapping between the item groups, I should be alright. Now they should despawn that way. Hell, maybe they'll give me armor if I kill them. Some of them are clearly wearing armor, so... Who knows? Wouldn't mind it. Be a nice boost. I kinda need it. I, ha I can punch... Look, death of a thousand paper cuts, yo. They'll die eventually. Also, the scroll roll does rotate the opposite way. I think it's going to myself. That's why it keeps confusing me. I keep scrolling the wrong direction. I made a very loud noise. Dev, careful about noise stacking. That, that's a thing that. Some developers are very bad at remembering. Like, if, if, if somebody picks up an item, makes a sound, okay. But if somebody picks up five items, does it make the sound stack three times? Or five times? That's not good if so, but usually that's usually what a developer... Developers can overlook that. Never have your sound stack. It sounds bad. It gets all loud and gross. I'm winning. This is a battle of attrition, folks. Their problem is they're, they're, they're attacking me in my summoning circle, and they cannot stop me in my summoning circle. I'm a demon being spawned from a ritual, after all. You can't stop me. Not permanently. Plus, I made this lovely little graveyard all by myself now. Try to go after the guy without armor because I figured he'll die faster, but. Oh no, I'm on a tree. I'm on a tree. Nope. Yeah, 
You will all die. One of your friends already has. It's just a matter of time, my friends. Anyways, I'm a demon, you're a skeleton. Shouldn't be on the same team. Like, come on. Created quite a maze now, haven't I? I'm actually gonna do. I'm gonna bring him up here. Come on. Find me right here, go guys. Come on. There you go. You don't stand a chance if you fight on top of me. Yeah, it's a really it's a really easy mistake to make, but it's also a really easy mistake to avoid the whole the whole sound stacky thing. We saw it with some sage games too. It's an unfortunate circumstance. Of uh just forgetting. So there's a little tip for you, Deb. Oh, did I just learn something? Oh, oh boy. I just learned a cheese tactic. <laughs> Who knew the best the best weapon was a crafty table? The fact that all three of them got stuck really indicates to me that that crafty table is valuable. <laughs> Skeletus! Oh my god! Hold on a minute. You don't say. I was wondering what that I am floating below me was. Okay, hold on a minute. Uh, wooden sword, weapon attack 15. Okay, 15 and durability. Skeletus sword, attack 30 and durability 80. Well, that's a good start. So I knew there would be. I knew it would be possibly would be worthwhile fighting skeletons that looked armed or armored. Oh, the raves block me too, by the way. Absolutely do. Well, can I, hey guys, can you find where I spawn? I'm not sure if I could find on the map where I spawn. Please help me look. I'm not really, I'm not completely sure where I spawn from. Um. <laughs> well, it's night again. Let's see. That was very lucrative. Can I pull over more enemies to fight on my top of my gravestone? Alright, hold on. I should want to see. I'm gonna make everybody ha- Motherfucker, let me make... Motherfucker, let me craft torches, but I had no inventory space, so they immediately deleted. This is definitely a development build. <laughs> Also help a little bit. Okay. I have left my gravestone yard. Uh, let's see. Now I, I need more chests, so let's make more chests. Also, that other chest, though, I just realized. Can I? Good. I heard that. When I, oh, am I? I'm literally dropping them. Oh, god damn it! All right, come with me, evil plants. I don't want. All right, there we 
we go. I'm, uh, well. I want to raid this company. Okay, cool. Actually, that's actually it's cool. I'm fine with that. I'm not really sure like what I should hold on to and what I shouldn't. Oh, that is a raid. All right, guys, come on. Oh no, I'm attacking my crafting table. Maybe don't. Maybe don't fight. Wait, how did I not hit my craft table? Oh, because punching is different. Punching aims directly at the spot while weapons and tools aim in an arc. And I just broke my torch. Ow. Okay. Yeah, it's a bit clunky, this game. But it's a development build, so I can I kind of understand it to some degree. I do think it could be better though, certainly. Oh, I see. It's where I, oh, I get it. Wherever I dr press Q, that's where the item drops. So if I'm aiming over here, it goes drops over there. I understand now. Okay. Let's make another chest. Okay, more twine. Actually, fuck it. A bit more. Didn't have quite enough to make two, but that's okay. Okay. So, in this chest... Stuff I know I need is gonna go in here, so. I'm not liking the chest size. Actually, for me, a survival game breathes, lives and dies based on its chest size for me. It may seem kind of silly to say that, but it legitimately makes that big of a difference to me. I, if, uh,. If I, if I can't store stuff without spending a lot of time building a lot of chests and thus gathering materials for a lot of chests, that makes the beginning of the game way harder to actually enjoy. Um, which, yeah. Also... Yay. <laughs> Skulls. The fact I can't make stone tools is also bothering me quite a bit. I do believe I need to smelt some iron, so. Suppose, oh, I need more vines, right? Well, off to seek out vines, probably going south west. Though we're about to, we're about to run out of the hour. I don't know, guys. It's in an early state, but, and it is a single de developer project. I don't hate this or anything, don't, don't get me wrong. I think that they're definitely trying real hard, and I could see some real ambition here. But at the same time, what is that? Hello? Oh god, it's a... Shit! Buggos! I found a buggo building. This could be problematic. It does seem like I have an exploit in mind, though. Let me, uh... Oh god, what the fuck are those? Where'd they come from? Shit. Ah! You know what? I'm just gonna... To finish off... I'm not very excited. I don't hate this game, again, but... I'm, it doesn't... There's a few things holding me back from enjoying it. Granted, I am... Uh, I will admit... Self-admit to being kind of picky with, uh... Shit. Okay. Never mind, I don't need it. 
Whoa, okay. Hi there, lizard that also doesn't have... Why is every creature that looks like it should have legs not have legs? You notice this? It looks like this could be prophecy in the future, but it's gonna need some time. It's certainly cute. I like it. It's, it's cute and it's, it's styling, but it needs more. Alright, I'm getting there. I'm getting to the edge of the world, everyone. Hopefully these fish are nice and don't attack me. They are kind of big. I kind of wish the game paused when you entered the map, at least on single player. Now, here's the thing. It does have multiplayer. It's currently really buggy, so I can see some potential here with multiplayer. I don't think this is something I'd ever enjoy single player for very long, but multiplayer could work. Ooh, seaweed. Are these also vines? I think they are. Seaweed gives you vines. That might be an easier way to get some vines, then. My current issue is also... The, the way the biomes spawn means that you could be walking for a while without, some, without being able to obtain some basic materials, which seems a little silly. So, what happens when I go to the edge? I really want to kill these birds that keep flying around. There's so many of them. <laughs> that is, uh... Not what I expected for a wall. I I saw that border, yes, but I did not expect that border to be literally a border. Like, white and red and black and everything. Uh, okay. Also, you can walk on it. This actually be a pretty effective way to just build a fuck off, I'm ignoring everything base. Fishing. Fishing. No? Okay. Oh yeah. Underleans is way too early to really judge right now, I feel, but it does have some potential. It's got a few issues. I really hope that they streamline. I get the survival game has to be grindy. Like, that's kind of part of the point to work your way up, but I think that there should be a lot of quality life things to still consider, such as having a chest just... Look, if you make it so that the chest has low, low inventory space and thus I have to build more chests, that's not really harder. It's not really challenging me. It's just wasting my time. It's just, you know... That's not a good use of a grind. Um... Stuff like that could be streamlined out better. But, uh, yeah, this has potential. I guess just keep a casual eye on it and see where it goes for the next year or so, I'd say. But, uh, yeah. That's Underlings.